In this article we are going to explore the subject of forests, along with their unique characteristic and tranquil beauties. Please do not forget to like, share and subscribe to our channel, that will be greatly appreciated. A forest is a large area of land that is dominated by trees and other woody vegetation. It is characterized by a dense growth of trees, creating a complex ecosystem that supports a wide variety of plants, animals, and microorganisms. Forests can be found in different regions and climates around the world, ranging from tropical rainforests to temperate and boreal forests. Forests play a crucial role in maintaining the balance of our planet's ecosystems. They provide habitat and shelter for numerous species, contribute to climate regulation by absorbing carbon dioxide and releasing oxygen, help prevent soil erosion, and play a vital role in the water cycle by promoting rainfall and maintaining water quality. Forests also offer various economic and social benefits, including timber and non-timber forest products, recreational opportunities, and cultural significance for indigenous communities. The structure of a forest consists of different layers or strata, including the canopy, uppermost layer of trees, understory, lower layer of vegetation, shrub layer, and forest floor, ground level. Forests can vary in composition, with different species of trees and other plants depending on factors such as climate, soil type, and geographical location. Overall, forests are essential ecosystems that contribute to the health of our planet and support a wide range of ecological There are several different types of forests, each characterized by unique ecological features and vegetation. Here are some of the main types of forests. Tropical rainforests. Found in the equatorial regions, these forests are characterized by high temperatures, abundant rainfall, and a rich diversity of plant and animal species. They have dense vegetation and tall trees that form a multi-layered canopy. Temperate forests. These forests occur in regions with moderate climate and distinct seasons. They are composed of deciduous trees that shed their leaves in the fall and evergreen trees that retain their leaves year-round. Boreal forests, also known as taiga, these forests are found in the northern regions of the world, near the Arctic Circle. They have cold winters, short growing seasons, and are dominated by coniferous trees such as spruce, fir, and pine. Montane forests, found in mountainous regions, these forests occur at higher elevations with cooler temperatures. They often exhibit a mix of coniferous and broadleaf trees, and their composition can vary depending on altitude and local climate. Mangrove forests. Mangroves are specialized forests that grow in saline coastal areas and brackish water. They consist of salt-tolerant trees and shrubs with unique aerial roots that help them withstand tidal fluctuations. Dry forests. These forests occur in arid or semi-arid regions with limited rainfall. They have adapted to dry conditions and often feature drought-tolerant trees and shrubs. Coniferous forests, also known as evergreen forests, these are dominated by coniferous trees that bear needle-like leaves and produce cones. They are common in northern regions and mountainous areas. Deciduous forests, these forests are composed of trees that shed their leaves during the winter season. They are typically found in temperate regions and display a variety of vibrant colors during the fall. These are just a few examples of the diverse types of forests found across the globe. Each type has its own unique characteristics, species composition, and ecological significance. Forests play a crucial role in maintaining the health of our environment and provide a wide range of benefits. Here are some ways in which forests contribute to the environment. Carbon sequestration. Forests are excellent carbon sinks, absorbing carbon dioxide, CO2, from the atmosphere through photosynthesis. Trees store carbon in their biomass and soil, helping to mitigate climate change by reducing greenhouse gas concentrations. Oxygen production. Through photosynthesis, forests release oxygen into the atmosphere, providing a vital oxygen supply for humans and other organisms. Biodiversity conservation. Forests are home to a vast array of plant and animal species, supporting rich biodiversity. They provide habitat, food, and shelter for numerous organisms, including endangered and endemic species. Watershed protection. Forests play a crucial role in water regulation and conservation. They act as natural filters, helping to purify water by trapping sediments and absorbing pollutants. 
Forests also help maintain a stable water cycle by regulating the flow of rivers and streams, reducing the risk of floods and droughts. Soil conservation. Forests help prevent soil erosion by reducing the impact of rain and wind on the soil surface. The roots of trees bind the soil together, protecting it from degradation and promoting nutrient cycling. Climate regulation. Forests have a significant impact on local and regional climates. They provide shade, reduce surface temperatures, and regulate humidity. Forests also contribute to the formation of rainfall, as trees release moisture through transpiration, which aids in cloud formation and precipitation. Air quality improvement. Trees and forests absorb airborne pollutants, such as particulate matter and nitrogen dioxide, improving air quality in surrounding areas. Natural resources. Forests provide valuable renewable resources, including timber, fuelwood, medicinal plants, and non-timber forest products that support local communities and economies. Recreational and cultural value. Forests offer opportunities for outdoor recreation, tourism, and cultural activities. They provide spaces for hiking, camping, wildlife observation, and serve as important cultural and spiritual sites for indigenous communities. Aesthetic beauty. Forests contribute to the scenic beauty of landscapes, enhancing the visual appeal of natural environments. Overall, forests are essential for the well-being of our planet and play a vital role in maintaining ecological balance and providing a wide range of environmental benefits. Forests face various threats, both human-induced and natural, that can have significant impacts on their health and sustainability. Here are some major threats to forests. Deforestation. Deforestation refers to the permanent removal or clear-cutting of forests, primarily for agricultural expansion, logging, infrastructure development, and urbanization. It leads to the loss of forest cover and biodiversity, disrupts ecosystems, and contributes to climate change. Illegal logging. Illegal logging involves the unauthorized and often unsustainable harvesting of timber from forests. It depletes forest resources, undermines sustainable forest management practices, and contributes to habitat destruction and biodiversity loss. Forest degradation. Forest degradation occurs when forests suffer from human activities or natural causes, leading to a decline in their health and quality. It can result from selective logging, unsustainable harvesting of non-timber forest products, overgrazing, and invasive species. Climate change. Climate change poses a significant threat to forests. Rising temperatures, changes in rainfall patterns, and increased frequency and intensity of extreme weather events can negatively impact forest ecosystems, leading to increased forest fires, pests, diseases, and changes in species composition and distribution. Forest fragmentation. Forest fragmentation refers to the breaking up of continuous forest areas into smaller, isolated patches due to human activities such as agriculture, infrastructure development, and land conversion. Fragmentation disrupts ecological connectivity, hampers wildlife movement and gene flow, and reduces the overall resilience of forest ecosystems. Invasive species. Invasive species can have detrimental effects on forest ecosystems by outcompeting native species, altering habitat structure, and disrupting ecological processes. They can negatively impact biodiversity and disrupt the natural balance of forest ecosystems. Forest fires. Uncontrolled forest fires both natural and human-induced, can cause extensive damage to forests. They can lead to the loss of forest cover, destruction of habitat, and release of large amounts of carbon dioxide into the atmosphere. Pollution. Air and water pollution from industrial activities, mining, agriculture, and improper waste disposal can have adverse effects on forests. Pollution can damage vegetation, contaminate water sources, and disrupt ecosystem processes. Infrastructure development. Large-scale infrastructure projects such as roads, dams, and mining operations can lead to the clearance of forests, habitat fragmentation, and disruption of forest ecosystems. Unsustainable agricultural practices. Unsustainable agricultural practices, including slash-and-burn agriculture, monoculture plantations, and excessive use of pesticides and fertilizers, can contribute to forest degradation and loss, particularly in tropical regions. Addressing these threats requires a combination of sustainable forest management practices, conservation efforts, policy interventions, community involvement, and global cooperation to protect and restore the world's forests. 
Forests are incredibly important for supporting biodiversity as they provide habitat, food sources, and shelter for a wide range of plant and animal species. Here are some ways in which forests support biodiversity. Habitat creation. Forests serve as complex and diverse ecosystems, providing a variety of microhabitats for different species. They offer diverse niches such as the forest floor, understory, and canopy, which support a range of plants, insects, mammals, birds, and reptiles. Forests provide shelter, nesting sites, and breeding grounds for many species. Species diversity. Forests house an enormous variety of plant and animal species, many of which are specialized and adapted to specific forest ecosystems. This includes a wide array of tree species, understory plants, fungi, mosses, and ferns. Forests also support a rich diversity of animal life, including mammals, birds, reptiles, amphibians, insects, and invertebrates. Food and resources. Forests provide an abundance of food resources for many species. Trees produce fruits, nuts, seeds, and flowers that serve as important food sources for birds, mammals, and insects. Forests also support herbivores that feed on leaves, bark, and other plant materials, forming the base of the food chain. Mutualistic relationships. Forests foster intricate relationships between species, including mutualistic interactions. Many plant species rely on specific pollinators, such as bees, butterflies, and birds, for reproduction. Forests also host mycorrhizal fungi that form symbiotic associations with tree roots, aiding in nutrient absorption and benefiting both the fungi and the trees. Genetic diversity. Forests play a crucial role in maintaining genetic diversity within species. They provide large areas for gene flow, allowing for genetic exchange between populations. This genetic diversity helps species adapt to environmental changes, enhances their resilience to diseases, and supports long-term survival. Ecological balance. Forests contribute to maintaining ecological balance and stability. The interconnectedness of species within forest ecosystems helps regulate populations, control pest outbreaks, and promote nutrient cycling. Forests also provide important ecosystem services such as water purification and soil stabilization, which support overall ecosystem health. Migration corridors. Forests can act as migration corridors, allowing for the movement of species between different habitats. They provide connectivity between fragmented habitats, enabling the dispersal of plants and animals and facilitating genetic exchange. Conserving and protecting forests is essential for safeguarding biodiversity. By preserving forest ecosystems and implementing sustainable forest management practices, we can help maintain the incredible richness of species and ensure the long-term survival of biodiversity. Reforestation and afforestation, the process of restoring and establishing forests, offer numerous benefits for the environment, society, and the economy. Here are some key benefits. Carbon sequestration. Trees are natural carbon sinks, meaning they absorb and store carbon dioxide from the atmosphere through photosynthesis. Reforestation and afforestation initiatives help combat climate change by capturing and storing significant amounts of carbon, thereby reducing greenhouse gas emissions and mitigating the impacts of global warming. Biodiversity conservation. Restoring and creating forests provide habitat for a diverse range of plant and animal species. Reforestation and afforestation projects contribute to the conservation of biodiversity by providing nesting sites, food sources, and shelter for various species. They help protect endangered and threatened species and support ecological balance. Soil conservation. Forests play a vital role in soil conservation. Tree roots help bind the soil, preventing erosion and landslides. Reforestation and afforestation projects help reduce soil degradation, enhance soil fertility, and promote sustainable land management practices. Water cycle regulation. Trees play a crucial role in regulating the water cycle. They intercept rainfall, reduce surface runoff, and increase groundwater recharge. Reforestation and afforestation initiatives help improve water quality, prevent water pollution, and contribute to the sustainable management of water resources. Air quality improvement. Forests act as natural filters, purifying the air by absorbing pollutants and releasing oxygen. Reforestation and afforestation projects help improve air quality, reduce air pollution, and mitigate the impacts of harmful pollutants. 
Economic opportunities. Reforestation and afforestation initiatives can create economic opportunities and support local communities. They generate jobs in the forestry sector, including tree planting, forest management, and monitoring activities. Sustainable forest management practices also promote the sustainable use of forest resources, such as timber and non-timber forest products, contributing to local economies. Climate resilience. Forests play a critical role in enhancing climate resilience. They provide protection against extreme weather events, such as storms and floods, by acting as natural buffers and stabilizing landscapes. Reforestation and afforestation projects help strengthen ecosystem resilience, reduce vulnerability to climate change impacts, and enhance ecosystem services. Aesthetics and recreation. Restored and newly established forests enhance the beauty of landscapes and provide recreational opportunities. They offer spaces for hiking, camping, birdwatching, and nature-based tourism, promoting physical and mental well-being and fostering a connection with nature. Reforestation and afforestation efforts are essential for restoring degraded lands, conserving biodiversity, mitigating climate change, and promoting sustainable development. By investing in these initiatives, we can reap a multitude of benefits for the environment, society, and future generations. How do forests affect climate change? Forests play a crucial role in mitigating climate change and its impacts. Here are some ways in which forests affect climate change. Carbon sequestration. Forests act as carbon sinks by absorbing carbon dioxide, CO2, from the atmosphere through photosynthesis. Trees store carbon in their trunks, branches, leaves, and roots, thus helping to reduce the concentration of greenhouse gases that contribute to global warming. Forests are estimated to store about 80% of the Earth's above-ground terrestrial carbon. Carbon storage. Forests not only absorb carbon dioxide but also serve as long-term carbon storage. When trees die and decompose, the stored carbon is slowly released back into the atmosphere. However, in healthy and undisturbed forests, the balance between carbon uptake and release favors carbon storage, contributing to a net removal of CO2 from the atmosphere. Albedo effect. Forests influence the Earth's albedo, which refers to the amount of solar radiation reflected back into space. Forests have a lower albedo than barren land or urban areas, meaning they absorb more sunlight and heat. This can create localized cooling effects and help regulate temperature, especially in regions with high forest cover. Water cycle regulation. Forests play a vital role in regulating the water cycle which in turn affects climate patterns. Trees intercept rainfall, reduce surface runoff, and increase evapotranspiration, contributing to cloud formation and precipitation. Forests help maintain moisture levels in the atmosphere and influence regional rainfall patterns, thus affecting climate and weather conditions. Air quality improvement. Forests improve air quality by acting as natural filters. They absorb air pollutants such as nitrogen dioxide, sulfur dioxide, and particulate matter, thereby reducing air pollution levels. Cleaner air promotes human health and mitigates the impacts of air pollution on climate change. Climate regulation. Forests help regulate local and regional climates through evapotranspiration, which is the process of water vapor release from plants. This evaporation cools the air and helps regulate temperature and humidity levels. Forests can influence microclimates, create temperature gradients, and provide shade, contributing to localized climate regulation. Ecosystem resilience. Forest ecosystems are highly resilient to climate change impacts. They provide habitat and food sources for a diverse range of species, supporting biodiversity and ecological balance. Healthy and diverse forests are better able to adapt to changing climatic conditions, including extreme weather events, and maintain their functions and services. It is important to protect and sustainably manage forests to maximize their climate change mitigation potential. Preventing deforestation, promoting reforestation and afforestation efforts, and implementing sustainable forest management practices are crucial steps in combating climate change and ensuring the long-term health and resilience of forest ecosystems. Forests provide a wide range of economic values and contribute to local, national, and global economies. Here are some of the economic benefits of forests. Timber and wood products. One of the most significant economic values of forests is the production of timber and wood products. 
Forests provide a sustainable source of timber for various industries, including construction, furniture manufacturing, and paper production. Timber exports contribute to local and national economies and support employment in the forestry and wood processing sectors. Non-timber forest products. Forests offer a diverse array of non-timber forest products, NTFPs, that have economic value. These include fruits, nuts, mushrooms, medicinal plants, resins, fibers, and honey. NTFPs provide livelihood opportunities for local communities, supporting small-scale businesses, traditional crafts, and the sustainable harvesting and trade of forest resources. Ecotourism and recreation. Forests attract tourists and outdoor enthusiasts, contributing to the tourism industry and local economies. Forested landscapes provide opportunities for hiking, camping, birdwatching, wildlife viewing, and nature-based tourism activities. Ecotourism promotes sustainable development and generates income for local communities through accommodations, guided tours, and other related services. Carbon markets and payments for ecosystem services. Forests play a vital role in carbon sequestration, making them valuable in the context of carbon markets and payments for ecosystem services, PES. Forest carbon credits can be traded in international and domestic markets, providing financial incentives for forest conservation and sustainable management. Forest-based PES schemes reward landowners and communities for maintaining forest ecosystem services, such as watershed protection, biodiversity conservation, and carbon storage. Employment and livelihoods. Forests create employment opportunities, particularly in rural areas where they are often located. Forest-related activities such as logging, tree planting, forest management, and forest restoration projects generate jobs in the forestry sector. Additionally, forest-based industries, such as wood processing, furniture manufacturing, and ecotourism, provide employment and income for local communities. Water resource management. Forests contribute to water resource management, which has economic implications. Forests help regulate water flow, improve water quality, and reduce soil erosion. Healthy forests contribute to the availability of clean water for various uses, including agriculture, industry, and domestic consumption, thus supporting economic sectors that rely on reliable water supplies. Genetic resources and bioprospecting. Forests harbor a rich diversity of plant and animal species, providing valuable genetic resources. These resources have potential applications in pharmaceuticals, biotechnology, agriculture, and other industries. Forest biodiversity can be a source of economic opportunities through bioprospecting and the development of new products and technologies. It is important to recognize and promote the economic values of forests to support sustainable forest management, conservation efforts, and the well-being of forest-dependent communities. By valuing and investing in forests, societies can reap both environmental and economic benefits. How are forests managed and protected? Forests are managed and protected through various approaches and strategies aimed at balancing ecological, social, and economic considerations. Here are some common methods and practices for forest management and protection. Forest management plans. Forest management plans are comprehensive documents that outline long-term goals and strategies for the sustainable use and conservation of forests. These plans consider ecological factors, such as biodiversity conservation and ecosystem health, as well as socioeconomic factors, such as timber production, livelihoods, and recreational opportunities. Forest management plans help guide decision-making and activities within a forested area. Sustainable Forest Management Sustainable Forest Management, SFM, is an approach that seeks to balance environmental, social, and economic objectives in forest management practices. It involves using forest resources in a way that maintains the long-term health and productivity of the forest ecosystem while providing social and economic benefits. SFM principles include maintaining forest biodiversity, ensuring regeneration and sustainable harvesting of timber, protecting water resources, and involving local communities in decision-making processes. Protected areas and conservation reserves. Protected areas, such as national parks, wildlife sanctuaries, and nature reserves, are established to conserve forest ecosystems and their biodiversity. These areas have legal protections and management regulations to minimize human impacts and maintain ecological integrity. Conservation reserves may also be designated for specific purposes, 
such as protecting endangered species or preserving unique habitats. In conclusion, forests, with their remarkable beauty and invaluable ecological contributions, are vital resources that require careful management and protection. They are not only home to an incredible array of biodiversity but also serve as a source of livelihoods, clean water, carbon sequestration, and countless other benefits. However, forests face significant threats such as deforestation, climate change, and unsustainable practices. To safeguard our forests, we must prioritize sustainable forest management practices, which involve balancing environmental, social, and economic considerations. This includes the development and implementation of comprehensive forest management plans, sustainable harvesting practices, the establishment of protected areas, and the involvement of local communities in decision-making processes. Forest certification, law enforcement, and international cooperation are also crucial components of effective forest management and protection. It is important to recognize that forests are more than just a collection of trees. They are complex ecosystems that provide essential services to both nature and humanity. By valuing and investing in forests, we can ensure their preservation for future generations, enhance biodiversity conservation efforts, combat climate change, support local economies, and promote sustainable development. In the face of ongoing challenges, the continued collaboration and commitment of governments, organizations, communities, and individuals are essential to protecting and restoring our forests. Together, we can create a sustainable future where forests thrive, providing us with their numerous ecological, social, and economic benefits. Let us cherish and protect these magnificent ecosystems, for they are our shared heritage and a critical part of our planet's well-being. Thanks for watching.